This is Credit Matters, and I'm Greg Moskowitz of the Global Fixed Income Research Group. According to the Bureau of Labor Statistics, the unemployment rate fell to 7%, representing low levels not seen since 2008. In addition, 203,000 jobs were added. With the improving employment numbers, there is a buzz in the marketplace as to when the Fed may pull back on its third round of quantitative easing. Meanwhile, the investment grade and speculative grade spreads have both tightened over the course of November by 3 basis points to 177 basis points and by 13 basis points to 461 basis points, respectively. Speculative grade issuance decreased to $4.2 billion from $4.7 billion over the past week, and the spread tightened by 5 basis points to 450 basis points. The speculative grade spread is tighter than both its one-year moving average of 500 basis points and its five-year moving average of 693 basis points. Investment grade issuance also decreased to $3.5 billion over the past week, and the spread contracted by 3 basis points to 173 basis points. The investment grade spread is tighter than both its one-year moving average of 182 basis points and its five-year moving average of 225 basis points. The bond yields with five-year maturities for the AAA, AA, single-A, triple-B, and double-B plus categories are 2.01%, 2.17, 2.37, 3.01, and 3.83 for this past week. When expanding the maturity to 25 years, the yields grow to 4.72, 5.01, 5.13, 6.18, and 7.19% respectively. This has been Credit Matters. Thank you for watching.